Alright guys, I am doing a super quick video today because my Teflon tape just come in the mail. Uh, so I thought I would Teflon my zipper foot, which as you can see is very clearly metal and not very slippy at all. Um, so I'm going to show you how I do it. I've already done one off camera, so I just re-Tefloned my already Teflon foot. Uh, but I just thought yeah, I'd show you how to do this, so if you have Teflon tape, to show you how to do it to all your others. So basically I just want to check how long I've got and chop off a little bit extra, uh, like so, and then I'm just going to lay it flat down and I'm going to try and get the straight edge as close as I can to the edge of the tape because that's going to be less cutting for me. So I got it right on that edge and then I'm just going to smooth it over the whole base of the foot. I'm going to really push it on there. I want to make sure it's properly stuck. Uh, so now you can see we've got a lot of excess. So I'm just going to take my craft knife um, and I'm just going to, from the bottom, I'm just going to push up along that metal edge. And it actually cuts quite easily. Uh, it won't rip though because it's got these awesome fibers in it because I already tried that on the other foot. So it won't rip but it does cut quite nicely. So see how I just ripped there? Oh, you probably can't see it. It probably won't focus. But I just tried to rip it and you get all these little bits. Um, so don't rip it because then they're hard to get off. So I'm actually going to snip off those now ripped bits because I don't think I'm going to have any luck using the knife. Uh, so on that edge, I'm just going to smooth that up around the corner, like so. So I've done most of it, except now we've obviously got where the hole, where the needle comes through. So I'm just going to take the very tip of my craft knife and I'm going to cut upwards and then just move the blade around the edge of the foot. Don't pull on it and don't rip it or you get these little fibers again, which I just did because that was a silly thing to do So I'm just gonna chip. I've got two little fibers so I just chop them off and so now the foot is Teflon So I'll grab some vinyl and show you and see if it works I literally just have a scrap of vinyl uh, and I'm just gonna fold it over so it's doing the two layers and I'm gonna see if it works Oh my god, can you guys see that? That is amazing. Normally, those stitches would not be beautiful like that. That is amazing. So, I think I paid $12 for this roll on eBay. Um, it's got heaps on there. You use like two inches or one inch at a time. Uh, so that'll probably be the only packet of Teflon tape I'll ever need to buy. But I highly recommend it. So I bought 13 mil. So there was different widths that you could get. I deliberately got the thicker one so that I can do some thicker feet if I want to. Because uh, I do have quite a lot of feet that would be handy. Like this one. I've got this really cool skinny one, but obviously no good for vinyl. Whereas now, I'm going to do that. Uh, so I hope this was helpful. And I will be posting another video probably tomorrow. Bye guys. Bye.